Hey guys, good morning. I wanna to talk to you about how your obedience can be tied to your victory. I wanna tell you the story in the Bible that comes from 2 Kings about a man named Naaman. Now, Naaman was a mighty official and he had leprosy. Now, back in those days, we know that leprosy was basically a death sentence, right? And so the servant girl that worked for him saw that he had leprosy. And she said, I know that a prophet that can heal you. So of course he was excited and of course he was curious. And so he went on to see if he could be healed. But when it gets to the man of God, he tells him, go dip in the Jordan seven times. But he gets offended by the instructions of the prophet because he feels like there's a better way. He's like, why can't I go dip in cleaner waters? Why must I go dip in the Jordan? The Jordan was seen as something that was just dirty beneath him. It wasn't the place to go. Um, and so he was very um, angry, the Bible says, angry, disgusted, <laughs> and he walked away. But thank God for the servant, the servant girl who had the wisdom to say, sir, my good sir, why not be made whole? Why not be cleansed? If it just takes you dipping in this water for you to be healed, why walk away? And her words touched him, the wisdom that she had. And he turned back to the prophet and he dipped in the Jordan seven times. Child of God, what is it that God has asked you to do? But you feel like you're above it. You feel like surely there's a better way. This is silly. This doesn't make sense. And you walk away from the instructions of the man or woman of God that he has sent to you. Don't deny your own healing. Don't deny your own victory because of your lack of obedience. Go and dip in the Jordan seven times and be made whole. Naaman that day learned that God was the mighty God of Israel, that he was the most powerful and the most high, and there was none other. That day he learned the power of God. Child of God, go and be made whole. Don't let your pride, don't let your disobedience keep you from being healed. I'll talk to you soon. Bye.